Hi and welcome to the next video in this showing of my collection series in which I'm going to show you this shelf with um, yeah, Russian, uh, actually Soviet um, vehicles and tanks and some guns and minifigures. Um, this is going to be a short video because I'm a little bit of lack of time but um, in the previous one I told I would do it together with this one but I'm gonna save that one for a later moment um, for now let's dive into these um, vehicles and these models and if you want to see my f videos about previous shells you should check out the link up there so I first start with these fix in the front row these two are um, um, yeah, they they are made with uh, the sticker packs of Brickmania, uh, two snipers, um, a male and a female. Uh, and this minifigure is from Custom Brick Ita. I did a review video on this one. You should check that one out. Really good figure. Um, this one is made made by myself with a torso of the Star Wars figure. Um, I saw some pictures on Instagram about. Uh, I think it was United Bricks, I'm not for sure who made Molotov Cocktails and I like that build so I made that one too. And here some more sticker pack figures, also Brick Mania sticker packs and then I got this one, Let's take this one off, it's Marshall Shukov, as you can see Brick Mania figure. Nice figure, happy to have it in my collection. I bought it from a used products website very cheaply. And then we got a first gun. This is the Maxime gun. Uh, also did a review video on this one. So if you didn't see that already, uh, you can build this one yourself by using my tutorial video. Uh, the same goes for this. And this one is an um, M1942 45mm anti tank gun. Uh, the design is by Game Brick. He made it all in dark blues, no, in dark green and black. I turned it uh, into cheap parts. Um, yeah, made this one and made a tutorial video out of it so you could also check out that one. And I also did a tutorial video on this little T20 oh, and how it comes some more let's I'm probably butchering that name all the way Russian uh, Russian tractor arm tractor I really like this model um, it's based on several designs I saw online and um, I yeah I, I made it my own go or edit and I yeah, hope you like it and if you want to you can build it because there's a tutorial video on it oh this one it's breaking down a bit let me fix that this is the gas 67 um, designed by brick mania um, at the original design there's also a, a rack in the rear for making uh, canvas cover but um, yeah I did my go at it and because I didn't have the I don't have the um, canvas cover I decided not to put on the rack uh, construction for that one on it nice little Russian Soviet Jeep next one is a tank and this one is the T26 also Brickmania design, actually all the ones that come from this point on are Brickmania designs. Um, I believe this is a really old model, old design. Um, still I love it, uh, it's a nice little tank. It was one of the first tanks I built and yeah, still liking it very much. And then this, let's make some space for this one. This big boy is the old famous Soviet T-34 
34 and this is the slash 76 uh, Soviet tank um, one of the, I think this is one of the most produced tanks in World War II at least at the Soviet side not for sure um, really really nice opponent for the, the Panzers and uh, as I believe um, history taught us that the Russians really surprised the Germans the hell out of them with this uh, with this tank be, be, being a really really good opponent for their Panzers um, features at this one uh, at that one was only an opening hatch at this one it's not much more than that it's an opening hatch on top turret spins of course elevating gun no hatches here oh yeah there's a hatch on here I'm not gonna try to open it with one hand it's not gonna fail epically so I'm not gonna try it and a hatch rear yeah I really really am happy to have a T34 I really want to have the new uh, 3485 from Bitmania I'm still uh, in the process of getting my hands on those instructions and building that one. Oh, I figured it should start falling okay let's take this one put you a little bit back um, this one the gas triple A I really like this truck um, if I read correctly this is based on um, uh, the US uh, Ford trucks um, um, I'm not sure if my history knowledge is correct but I thought I think the uh, the US uh, Ford company uh, handed the uh, license to build this uh, truck in uh, to the Soviets and um, yeah they made it into the car gas AAA and um, yeah they this one became one of the main uh, transport vehicles for the Soviet army they also and that brings us to the next model made a lot of uh, modifications to it being it more um, yeah uh, weaponized for combat uh, this design also is from Britmania and this is let me peek how to call it this 72k gun uh, anti-aircraft gun um, mounted onto a gas AAA um, yeah they mount a lot of different stuff to it and this was one of them and Britmania made a really nice add-on pack for it and yeah I like I like it and I like this way the uh, I'll probably break it if I try to make it with one hand. Yeah, I'm gonna break it with one hand. But if you elevate it, um, this part will elevate, uh, you know, turn with it. It's really, really cool. And like I said, this one is gonna be a short video because I'm a little bit of lack of time. So the, we already have the last uh, vehicle, and this is the Gas AA, a uh, smaller brother of that one. As you can see, this one has. Uh, two axes at the rear and this one has only one so it's actually the same car with only one axle at the rear and this one has a canvas brick built canvas cover I always like when the stuff is brick built instead of using custom parts but that's known by now well um, yeah I, I want you this is a short video and um, falling apart um, I'm keeping it with this for now um, I will make a video on this shelf probably for next week not sure if it's gonna happen because um, here in the Netherlands it's uh, vacation season is starting and of course I'm heading out for a small vacation with my wife and kids so I'm not sure if I'm able to uh, film some videos uh, before that so I can upload them uh, during my vacation um, but for now I hope you like this video and um, like I said there are several models in the shelf you can build by using my tutorial videos 
I hope you have enjoyed. I really hope to get some comments because I really like to interact with you guys. Um, I hope for a lot of likes and if you did not already subscribe, please subscribe. It's helping me big time. Um, yeah, thank you for watching. Hope to see you next time in my next video. Bye bye.